Southern Lights is a large-scale lighting installation that's being done by artist Chris Robinson using laser light. The idea was concepted by an idea hub here, which lives under the umbrella of Ingenuity SC. It's called What's Next Midlands, and it's a place where anyone can go to submit an idea, big or small, for how to make the Midlands a better, cooler place to live. And so this idea came from someone who said, you know what, let's light a bridge. So the main portion of the installation will live between the Gervais and Blossom Street bridges with smaller, more intimate installations to view along the way. Chris is an artist that has done this sort of work for years using lasers and laser installations, light installations, and really exploring the boundaries of art and science. Uh, he's always had a fascination with the, with the idea of laser light, its coherentness, its sort of structural quality. He was looking for a sort of large scale piece that would really define his career, and I think this is it. The South Carolina State Museum is actually going to be maintaining the piece and treat it as if it were an exhibit. And one of their exhibits in the museum is dedicated to the late Dr. Charles Towns, who invented the Maser and then was later credited for inventing the laser. So we're really proud that this piece represents as well a native South Carolinian and an invention that's had such a significant impact on the 21st century. As uh, Chris will often say, you know, lasers cut fabric. They um, help manufacture automobiles and they scan your groceries at Walmart, but we don't often see them or experience them in person and in this particular way. So this is going to be a really unique way to experience laser light, light form that we very rarely see. I think this piece does several things. Uh, it, first of all, it, it highlights the unique quality of laser light, that something that people don't often get to interact fairly closely with or see in this way and it showcases it at a fairly high power as well. The piece also showcases the rivers and, and kind of highlights a unique feature of our city in how it's kind of a, a quiet contemplative space in the middle of a big city. This kind of project is expansive and, and that's another unique part of this piece is how large scale it is stretching between two bridges. I think that this piece is something unlike any other city has to offer. Southern Lights is significant because it's going to be the only installation of its kind in the United States. And the reason for that is there aren't a lot of long-term laser installations. In fact, there aren't a lot of laser artists. Chris is one of just uh, a few people in the world who does installations like these. So it's a really big deal. There is one other one in the world and it's in London. It's something that really can define us, and I think it has such good roots in the history of Charles Towns being from South Carolina, and we have such an opportunity with our rivers, and this is something that can really showcase our rivers, showcase how the Midlands is all united under art, and be a piece that we get recognized for nationally.